Welcome back to the next episode of Dark Souls 3. It's been a little while, but you know, for me, not so much you. Let's uh, go help some NPCs out. Answer Sirius of the Sunless Realms call for cooperation and be summoned as a phantom. Sure. Yep, good, clean, bloody fun. That's how it's going. It's been two days since I last did Dark Souls, so I'm a little out of practice. Just a tiny bit. It's fine. It's probably fine. It's probably not probable. Problem. It's probably not problems. I've got five of those talismans on me, so I'm hoping I can stop this stupid idiot from healing this time. Because last time it was just a pain in my butt. Alright, where are you at? There you are. Come here! Okay. Get him. He dodged me. Okay, I got him. Now I'm just going to uh, fire on him a lot. This NPC, this Kraton the Wanderer, is the worst person. Oh, there. Okay. That's it. I'm bowing you. Okay, he is really good at dodging. And I've got to stop him from healing, too. Woo! Yep, no healing for you. Stop that. Stop. Wait. Have the thing on you! Why did you heal? Why did you just heal? You were definitely under the effect of the thing. That's trash. You're trash. Get drive-by. Okay, apparently he's got items that aren't Estus Flasks that heal. So I'm just going to do drive-bys until he dies. The drive-bys are going quite well. Okay. See, the problem when he heals isn't me so much as Cirrus. Cirrus has been getting their butt kicked by this guy. But, you know, if I can uh, keep up the pressure, maybe we can run him out of HP. Oh, this is fun. I do like the drive-by sword. It's very good. Pressure! Oh my god, and he's got the Estus Flasks. I hate this guy. You know what now? Okay, dodge. Don't get killed. Just do your drive-bys. Keep them weakening. Sirius has got this. Just keep doing your drive-bys and not getting hit. Finish him! Woo! Duty fulfilled! I got you, Sirius! Thank you for your kind assistance. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. Wait. Oh, you were the, N the NPC I met at the fire. Now I know who you are. Hey! Happy to help? Right, I gotta open up my case. Temperature. Whoa! Got really far high really fast. Whoops. Uh, calm down there, computer. You're kind of scaring me. Let's just move that. Okay. It's fine. I just gotta go a little easy for a bit. Let's go back to Firelink and make sure things are fine. And hopefully my computer chills out a little.
Computer, please chill. You're not chilling. Uh, hmm. Okay, that's... Oh, it's relaxing a little bit. It'll slowly relax. Oh, there she is. Hey, guess who helped you? It was me. Hmm. I have not thanked you for your generous rescue. That dark spirit was one of Rosaria's fingers. Vile, bastard offspring who lurk in the darkness. Oh. My sworn enemies. Oh. Fearsome invaders, to say the least. Right. I would not have made it alone. You have my deepest gratitude. Let's know, break a silver cat ring. Yeah, uh, those uh, fingers are the bastards, am I right? If you require help on your travels, I offer you my sign. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. Thanks. Um, yeah, definitely wouldn't want to be associated with those uh, fingers. That'd be pretty terrible. I'm glad I'm not. Uh, uh, <laughs> okay, blessed mailbreaker. Uh, get some faith scaling. Mostly it just gives you regen. What about that silver cat ring? That should be reduced damage on falling. Kitty! Prevent damage from falling. Silver ring depicting a leaping feline. Prevent damage from falling. In the age of gods, or possibly just following it, an old cat was said to speak a human tongue with the voice of an old woman in the form of a fanciful immortal. Yep. She sure did. I mean, I haven't invaded anyone, but I sure ahead, sure did go ahead and grab the uh, covenant. Hey, now invade, and if you come on, <laughs> uh, I think it might be just because I haven't given anything to Rosaria yet that I don't count as one of the fingers. So I mean, I've been given the option to be a finger, but I'm not counting as one yet. Oh yeah, temperature is dropping now. That's good. Okay. Well, I mean, nothing will keep you from dying if you fall from a big enough height. You've just got to learn what is too big. Actually, wait, before or after? Uh, yeah, before we go after Wolf Dog, I've got something else in mind. There was... Okay, I'll admit, I've looked up areas I've been through so far to make sure I haven't missed anything gigantic. And I try to avoid spoilers, but I'm bad, so I've seen some. Nothing major, but I know a few things that I shouldn't know yet. You know, boo on me. I messed that one up. Anyway, I know how to get the items down to the bottom of this pit now. You recommend not going after the wolf dog? Why is that? Because it's going to kick my ass or is there a punishment for killing it? I don't care if there's a punishment for killing it. I want to fight it. I've got 43 souls. I've got nothing to lose. I'm a rebel without a cause. So apparently... Yep. There it goes. Now, okay. I was meant to be able to climb down that. I couldn't. Oh, not becoming a finger? Yeah, well, I mean, I've already got the Covenant available, so I think I'd only technically become a finger if I gave items to Rosaria, which I haven't done yet. Well, I mean, I was looking for a climb option. It didn't give me one. What do you mean, Gigi no re? Look, I read right now. Re! Re! It's fine. Let's try that again, this time with less failure. Does it repair? Yes. Uh, probably I can just Silver Cat ring that. Yep, no worries. Probably a few deep drops, so let's be careful. Even though this is... 
Okay, let's uh, stop silver catting. Back to Havels. What's up, Libs? What did I do? Anything down here? No. Okay. Try ranged battle. That's my speciality. Whoa, okay! Yep, I will be trying ranged battle now. That's fine. Whoa, okay! That is a lot of damage. Did I just hear someone invade? I swear I heard a summoning noise just now. Whoa! Okay! Okay! Hi! 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 Well, that scared the hell out of me. No, no. Stay up here. How am I missing? Center of mass. There we go, that's better. No? This guy! This guy! Luckily, AI abusable. How the hell? Some of these shots should really be landing. Luckily, he probably hasn't figured he can stick that hammer out through this doorway and kill me. You a silly boy. Oh, you figured it out. <laughs> okay. I mean, I deserved it. I was being a jerk. I was abusing AI. Okay, instead of this, let's just silver cat this one. So, now what am I gonna do? I really don't want to get in close against that guy. That's my big starting problem. Because I think I will die horribly. This is probably fine. See, it's fine. You could probably ride it down, except that would still probably kill you a lot. No! Never mind, PS4 spat the disc out again. Guess who's getting a preview image of my damn game station? What the hell is wrong with technology today? First, my CPU freaks out. And now my PS4 is spinning my disc out multiple times. Uh, everything is terrible. Everything's the worst. Good. Thanks, PS4. I appreciate that. I'm not going to use fire on it. Yeah, I know I didn't use quick game properly. I didn't have an option. Thanks. Pretty mad about that. Now that one, that one's got me feeling assault. Something is wrong with technology today. Well, I'm still gonna, you know, do my best, but jeez. Jeez. It's not great. And 
would you have put me right back here? Do I still have my ring on? Yes. Down I go. I think I really saw the effect of Silver Cat Ring trigger there. Try ranged battle. Try ranged. Lots of try ranged battle advice. Hey. Please come here. Try shooting him in the leg a bit. Skyrim mean this. Nope, still really good range. I mean, okay. It's a working thing, and I've got a better center of aim now, I just gotta aim low. That one. That one, though. There's the mad. Well, it's working. I can't defi I can't deny the part where it's working. Seems to be about. A little more scary of a strategy than what I had to use against the Stray Demon, but it's still good. And I am definitely putting a lot of these arrows in his junk. Yeah, he seems very determined to come here and pay this to me. Yep. Go ahead, throw your tantrum. Whoa, okay. It's cool. I've never been bested by clipping and I never will. Woo. Also, he has some pretty good tells of when he's going to attack. Okay. This is the perfect time for me to roll off this cliff, by the way. Success! Wow, you are very excited by the soul of a demon! So that's the one. I think we knew about this a little too early in the game, but whatever. You are very excited by the prospect of me shooting this demon in the dick. Ah, uh, used to acquire numerous souls. Demons were born of the Chaos Flame, but the flame has not survived, and the demons are a dying race. Okay. Be wary of demon, but try mimicry. That's so. Uh, could have snuck past him? Ah, uh, never mind. Time for sleep talk, skeleton! <laughs> huh, it's a liar. Miscreant. Monster ahead. Yep, you can see that chain. That's the chain of a mimic. Well, I'm pretty sure it. Yep. So, I mean. Mimic solutions, am I right, folks? Thank you for the Black Blade. Silly Mimic. Black Blade. It's a Katana. 18 Strength and Dex. A little bit of Bleed Damage. A short Katana wielded by the Swordsman and Distinguished Guest of High Lord Walner. This shiny Black Blade is thick, but shorter than the typical Katana. Swordsman was a master of a rare technique, traces of which can be observed in this weapon's strong attack. I remember that one. Okay, cool. 
Maybe we'll play with some katanas later in the game. Alright, time for our second demon. <laughs> I'm kidding, there isn't another one. I hope. Gotta check! Skeleton! It'll be back in a moment. But it's gonna regret it when it does. There's the souls. That's a dead skeleton. Some skeletons have to double die. I do very much enjoy this Farron Greatsword though. Using it for drive-bys on uh, the Wanderer, whose name I've forgotten. Really good. Hey guy, you want to come up here? What the hell was that dodge? You want to come up here now? That perfect fireball dodge, making me look like a chump. And there's a few of them around now. I mean, it's fine. It's perfectly okay. Just need to block them at the stairs. And the souls come in. Falchion! Cool. Alright, now... That's better! Alright, you gonna come at me? Nope. Alright. Yeah, Creighton does sound familiar enough for me to think I've heard it before. I mean, I know the Wanderer thing is familiar, because Scriver the Wanderer is a Dark Souls and Demon Souls original. Whoa there! Okay, I've just attracted some more skeletons. Welcome to the Bone Zone! That was a good follow-up attack. Whoa, okay. Mr. Skeletal here wants to play a game. Hey. You ever heard of drive-bys? That's about what I expected. Fire orb. Well, yeah, that's what I thought. Bye. Another one bites the dust, and another one bites the dust, and another one down, and another one down, another one bites the dust. Hmm. Another one bites the dust. Love it. Cultural classic. Smack! Problem with skeletons is they fall apart, so I can't do a sweet follow up. I know you're about to repair. Not that time. Okay. Large soul of a nameless soldier. That wasn't remotely worth it. Hey, guy! Drive by! And slam! I do like skeleton fighting, actually. Look at that sweet move. Drive by! <laughs> okay. Any skeletons left? I'm pretty sure I've cleared them out. Okay, let's keep on heading down. 
I was about to say I've made a lot of souls off this, but I killed the demon. That's where they all came from. Really? Praise the bonfire, yeah. I mean, okay, I couldn't get back up to the higher one, so it makes sense. In a way. Old Sage's Blindfold and White Ring. Tire of Pyromancers of the Great Swamp, particularly faded by old sages. The large blindfold blocks out unnecessary light, allowing one to observe a pyromancy's true essence. The flame reveals all and obscures all. White Ring. Witch's Ring. Okay, greatly boosts pyromancies. The Witch of Isolith and her daughters, scorched by the Flame of Chaos, taught humans the art of pyromancy and offered them this ring. Greatly boosts pyromancies. Every pyromancer is familiar with the parable that tells of the witches espousing the need to fear the flame and teaching the art of pyromancy to men in hopes that they might learn to control it. Yeah, fear the old blood, not the flame. How are we doing here? We're fine. Are we on pit level yet? Be wary of monstrosity. That's... Smoldering Lake? Oh my god. Someone set Ash Lake on fire. Also, there's something out here. I don't want to lose 6k souls, but I want to know what it is. It's up and around here? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa, whoa! What's... What's happening? What's going on? Yeah, it's like a combo of Isolith and Ash Lake. What's happening? I can't see! Oh! Oh, I see something in the distance! Giant crabs! I wonder if the Eternal Dragon is still down here, and this is where I need to go for the Dragon Covenant. Ah, projectile. Who's firing this? Oh god! Came from above? Okay, well, this is way outside of my pay range. I'm coming here later. This is a later job. Yeah, thank you for that warning. Uh, that being said, maybe. Hmm. See, I saw things at the bottom of the pit in the catacombs of Carthus. So the fact that I haven't got those items yet says there's either a secret way there, or I have to go through the smoldering lake to get there. One of those things sounds true. Let's check for secret passageways. No, none of these are fitting to have secrets in them. You were the only likely one. Nope. I'll check this one just in case. Nope. Absolutely not. No secret here. Okay. I gotta say, I wasn't expecting Smoldering Lake. That's 
pretty excellent. Why are you alive? No, but seriously, where did you come from? I like busting them apart. I don't like that I'm just a little too weak to one-shot them. I need some more Titanite scales so I can upgrade this again. So let's just take a quick look out here. Oh no, 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 that is the lake. Okay, never mind. What I thought that was the pit bottom was the lake. Okay, everything's fine. My mental map of the area is 100% up to date now. We're going to go do something with these souls I've got. Then we're going to fight the wolf. No, we're going to wrap this episode up here. Thank you all for watching. Have a wonderful day. And when we return, it's time for the wolf battle. Bye-bye.